mercury in natural gas um, is a natural occurring uh, phenomena. Mercury is present in many, many gas reservoirs around the world. However, it does pose a problem. Uh, mercury is both a toxic contaminant, uh, it can cause uh, metal weld embrittlement, and can cause health issues about plant employees. So we're going to look at a natural, uh, liquid natural gas uh, plant uh, where mercury was an issue, but there are other things to consider besides uh, just the VLE. The basic chemistry here is that aluminum metal and mercury metal uh, will dissolve into each other and form this amalgam. The amalgam then can react with just a little bit of water to form an aluminum hydroxide species, liberating some hydrogen and reforming elemental mercury. So the mercury is now available to attack more aluminum. So if we have an aluminum surface, uh, the amalgam will constantly reform and then form this oxide. This oxide is not very stable uh, on metal surfaces and easily removed. So this is a very uh, simple uh, diagram, what, what I think is happening. In a normal surface, the aluminum metal will eventually oxidize to form an aluminum oxide film. This film is thermodynamically very stable. Occasionally, though, there will be some sort of damage to this oxide film, and the bare metal will be uh, exposed. This could be mechanical or chemical in nature. Normally, uh, this oxide uh, this, this, this pit will repassivate with more aluminum oxide right from the metal and heal itself. But it doesn't do that in the presence of mer mercury. Mercury, which is uh, metallic in nature, will f occasionally find this pit and attach itself to the metal. When it does so, it forms the amalgam and actually displaces the metal, uh, base metal here, in this case aluminum, our case study is actually to look at a failure in a liquid natural gas plant. This is a very simple uh, diagram 